people. Come and praise your maker. Come now and worship the Lord. Come all ye people. Come praise your maker. Come all ye people. Come praise your maker. Come all ye people. Come praise your maker. Come now and worship the Lord. Come all ye people, come praise your maker, come all ye people, come praise your maker, come all ye people, come praise your maker, come now and worship the Lord. Good morning everybody, welcome to the Disciples. We're really looking forward to hearing our story this morning from Catherine and our craft from Mary. But before we begin, shall we sing our welcome song? I say a line and you say a line. I am here, you are there. I am here, you are there. God is with us everywhere. God is with us everywhere. Let us come together, sing and clap. Let us come together, sing and clap. Share the love of God today. Share the love of God today. Should we put that all together? I am here, you are there. God is with us everywhere, let us come together, sing and clap, share the love of God today. Let's go over to Catherine for our story. Hello! Are we ready to sing our gathering song? Remember it? We've been singing this one for a few weeks now. We do let your kingdom come quickly. Come quickly. Come quickly. Let your kingdom come quickly in our world today. Are you ready? We'll sing it three times. Let your kingdom come quickly. Come quickly. Come quickly. Let your kingdom come quickly in our world today. Let your kingdom come quickly, come quickly, come quickly. Let your kingdom come quickly in our world today. Let your kingdom come quickly, come quickly, come quickly. Let your kingdom come quickly in our world today. Our song is all about praying for God's kingdom. But what is God's kingdom like? What are we praying for? I wonder what Jesus will say God's kingdom is like today. So we're nearly ready to tell our story. But first, we're going to learn our song for today. I think you might know the tune. It's the same as hot cross buns. And it goes like this. Pick, pick, pick. Pick, pick, pick. Pick the grapes, pick the grapes. Pick, pick, pick. Now we're going to do some actions with our song. So we're going to imagine that we're going to pick some grapes. Now we're all the way up here, look. So pick the grapes. We're going to go pick, pick. Pick, 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 pick the grapes, pick the grapes, pick, pick, pick. You try, you try. Ready to pick the grapes, you got your fingers ready. Pick, 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 pick the grapes, pick the grapes, pick, pick, pick. Well, now we've learnt our song. I think we're ready for our story. So, I'm going to disappear from my house that you can see here. And I'm going to zoom all the way into church to tell our story. See you in a moment. Jesus said, God's kingdom 
is like farm workers picking grapes. There was a farmer who picked grapes. Shall we be farmers? Let's be farmers. So, shall we see how our grapes are doing? We're going to try some. Mmm, you try one. I think they're nearly ready. I think we could pick them all tomorrow. Yep, I think they'll be ready tomorrow, so let's go to sleep. Oh, oh, it's the morning. The farmer got up really early with the sun. They're waking up. They go stretch and get all ready to go. So the farmer went to the marketplace. So shall we get up ready to go to the marketplace? So we're walking on the spot to the marketplace. You're walking, you're walking, you're walking. Walking, walking to the marketplace. And the farmer got to the marketplace. And at the marketplace, he showed some workers a big coin. Can you see my big coin in my hand? He said, if you help me pick my grapes, I will give you one big coin. Who'd like to work for me? And the farmer took some workers with him. So you're going to be workers with me. You're going to remember the action for picking grapes. And we're going to sing our song. Pick, 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 pick the grapes, pick the grapes, pick, pick, pick. That's fantastic. Oh, and the workers, they work for three hours. One, two, three hours. But look, there's still lots of grapes left to pick. So the farmer went back to the marketplace. You're going to walk to the marketplace? Go on, off you go. That's it, you're nearly there. And we're at the marketplace. There were more workers there. And the farmer said, if you help me pick the grapes, I will give you one big coin. Who'd like to help? So the workers went to pick the grapes. So now there's more of us. We all need to sing together. Pick, 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 pick the grapes, pick the grapes, pick, 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 pick the grapes, pick the grapes, pick, pick, pick. So they worked for three more hours. So another one, two, three more hours. But look, there's still loads of grapes left. We're going to need some more help, aren't we? So the farmer went to the marketplace and he said, if you help me pick the grapes, I'll give you fair pay. So the workers went to help pick the grapes. It was getting really hot now. Oh, can you show how hot it is? Oh, really hot. So we'll have to sing our song a bit slower because we'll be picking grapes slower, won't we? Pick, pick, pick. Pick, pick, pick. Pick the grapes, pick the grapes. Pick, pick, pick. <sighs> There's only one hour left now. And there's still lots of grapes to pick. And they'll be ruined if we don't pick all of them. So what do you think the farmer did? He went back to the marketplace. And there were some workers there. And they'd done nothing all day. What do you think the farmer said? He said... If you help me pick the grapes, I'll give you fair pay. So, the workers went to the vineyard. Quick, there's only one hour left. Quick, we've got to quickly pick all those grapes. Pick, pick, pick. Pick, pick, pick. Pick the grapes, pick the grapes. Pick, pick, pick. Whew. Oh, that's it. We've got them all. Working day's over. So we're all going to sit down.
because it's pay time. So first, the farmer called the workers who had just worked one hour. He said, come here. And they've hardly done any work at all. And they're bright and they're full of energy. She showed me full of energy. Show me full of energy. And the farmer gave them one big coin. How are you feeling? Does it make you feel good? So next, the farmer called the workers who had worked for three hours and six hours. One, two, three, four, five, six hours. We've been working almost all day. We're hot, we're tired, and the farmer gives us one big coin. How are we feeling now? Can you show me? Then the farmer called the first group. So you're going to be the first group. You woke up with the sun and worked hard all day for hours and hours and hours. Nine whole hours. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine whole hours. You're exhausted, really, really tired. Can you show me tired? Even tireder. Can't stand up properly, you're so tired. What do you think the farm is going to pay us? We've worked so much, longer than everyone else. And the farmer gives us one big coin. Exactly the same as everyone else. Is that fair? Can you show me how you feel? Well, in our story, the workers who'd worked all day said, that's not fair. So you're going to all be hard workers and show your cross face. That's not fair. You're going to stamp your feet and shout, that's not fair. Now well, let's sit down again and see what the farmer said. He said, you were happy to work for one big coin. I gave you one big coin. Take it and enjoy it. Then Jesus said, the first will be last and the last will be first. Everything's upside down. Let's try saying that together. My turn, your turn. The first will be last. The first will be last. And the last will be first. And the last will be first. Jesus said, God's kingdom is a place where everyone's given the same. Where the first are last and the last are first. Where everything's turned upside down. Now we sang a song about this just before Christmas. About everything being turned upside down. So you ready to do your upside down actions while we sing it? Oh my God is very big and I am very small. My God is a topsy-turvy God who turns things upside down. And those who are first will be last and those who are last will be first. My God is a topsy-turvy God who turns things upside down. Oh, I'm back home now. Ready to finish off our Diddy Disciples for today. Hello Diddy Disciples. Today you've been thinking about the farmer hiring the workers for one big coin to work in his fields, even though some of them worked a long, long time. And <clears throat> we're going to think about God's kingdom being turned upside down. So to do that craft, you're going to need a paper plate or a piece of card 
something to draw around. I've just picked a, a piece of pink paper because it shows up well. Um, you'll need some scissors, a glue stick, some felt tip pens or crayons, a cork if you're going to fix things together with a drawing pin or a paper fastener. Right, so let's do our craft. You can make whatever item you like. You've got to use your imagination. Think about something that you could make topsy-turvy. So, I thought I'd do a little man and make him stand topsy-turvy. Right, so to do that, you just draw yourself a person with some hands. Maybe an adult can help you do this. Some legs and some boots maybe. Another leg and a boot. He'd been working in the field. So there's his other hand. Right, so you're doing your person and then you cut it out. To save time, here's one I cut out earlier. Right, there's my little man. You might do it in a, a coloured paper like this one. Or white, whatever you like. So I've got my paper plate. Um, do a bit of decoration. Just pick whatever colours you want and you can colour around the outside. You can decorate it, you can do it with felt tip pens, you can do it with crayons, whatever you like, whatever you might have. Get an adult to help you if you need to. Right, so I'll just colour a little bit round the outside there just to make it look a bit decorative. You can use stickers, you can use finger paints, anything at all. Alright, so there's my rim on my plate. Can you see that? Right. So I've got my little man and I need to make a hole in it and can just about, if I put my cork, I've got a little bit of cork or it could be a bit of rubber to make the hole so you don't hurt your fingers and then push the paper fastener through and I've got to make the hole in my plate. Well, I'm going to use a sharper pair of scissors, but an adult will need to help you with this. And you can have the cork or something underneath if you're going to use a drawing pin. Right, like that. So you could put it through like that. Right, and have your pin in the middle and you can see the cork at the back just to make it nice and safe. Right, so this one I've got here is using a paper fastener. So just push that through, open it up on the back. Right, now it needs some decoration. There's the man on the plate. Right, all I need to do now is to do some decorating. I think he might need some eyes. I'll do it in black so it shows up. You can draw some eyes. If you've got googly eyes, you can put googly eyes on, give him some hair, a nice smiley mouth. And maybe some a jumper and some trousers. Right, and you can colour those in however you like. Doesn't need to be a man, could be a face, could be anything you like that is going to get turned upside down. Right, because the farmer paid the men who would only work for one hour in the field 
before he paid the men who had worked all day or for a lot longer time. <coughs> so let's give him a, a bit of colour for his top just to brighten it up a bit. There we go. He hasn't got a nose, I think he needs a little nose. There we are. So there's my man. Right, now what did we say? It was turned upside down. So let's see if we can do that. Oh, he's turning, he's turning, turning, turning. Oh, he's standing on his head. Wow, God's kingdom turns everything upside down. The last will be first, the first may be last. And here, the man is upside down. There's one I made earlier and I have put some Google eyes on that one. And this one I used two plates to turn him upside down. Or you could use a face and turn the face upside down. Whatever you like, have fun creating your topsy-turvy My Kingdom Come plate. Bye. So now we've made our craft. Now it's time for thinking and our prayer time. And what we're going to think about today are those great pickers who worked hard for God's kingdom. And we're going to think in our heads what we could do to bring about God's kingdom where everyone shares and everyone has enough. finish our prayer time with singing our Lord's Prayer. So I sing a line and then you sing a line. Our Father, our Father, who art in heaven, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, Thy kingdom come. Amen. Amen. And we're going to finish our time together. We're singing our peace song. So have you got peace in your fingers? And words in your head? And love in your heart? Ah, let's all sing about it together. I've got peace, peace, peace in my fingers, watch what I can do. I've got peace, peace, peace in my fingers, I'm going to share peace with you. I've got words, words, words in my head, watch what I can do. I've got words, words, words in my head, I'm going to say peace to you. Peace! I've got love, love. Love in my heart, watch what I can do. I've got love, love, love in my heart. I'm going to give some to you. I'm going to put it all together. I've got peace, peace, peace in my fingers. Words, words, words in my head. Love, love, love in my heart. I'm going to give some to you. I'm going to finish with Agnes singing our little light song. Now we normally sing this and we get to a big piece of cloth, don't we? Give it a big shake. So do you think you could do that too and join in? Are you ready? Little armor, I'm gonna let it shine. This little armor, I'm gonna let it shine. 
Thank you, Agnes, for helping lead us in our little Light of Mind song. Now, it's time for us to go. But hopefully I'll see you all next week. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.